So something I'm going to try is, got this bag of water crystals. They absorb water, they're a polymer, they hold water and release it as plants need. You add it to your soil. But what I wanna do is use it as the media to grow and use it instead of soil, kind of like the coconut choir, kind of like peat moss, whatever soilless media you want to use. I've got just some clay pellets down here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some of these in here and uh, a couple drops of this fertilizer. Complete one part fertilizer, no need to add other stuff. Let the water absorb into the crystals with the fertilizer. Dump a bunch in here, maybe I'll layer it up with different rock layers so that in case anything shrinks down between waterings, it's not as much of an issue. And we'll see if we can grow a plant. So here's kind of the breakdown of the nutrients. Pretty much everything a plant would need. This is very concentrated, so I'm just gonna put about a drop or two. One big drop, two. Okay. Put the cap back on here. Now I will put some water in here. Make sure it gets absorbed. Make sure the nutrients are nice and dissolved. So this comes with a scooper. And we're just going to arbitrarily put in amounts of these crystals until it looks like there's plenty. three scoops, and then we'll start around. We basically want to get these all to the, get this to the point where it's all just a big bowl of jelly. We're feeling we're going to need a lot more. Thicker. This is supposed to become clear and pretty much visible to see in the water once they're fully absorbed. After a few minutes, this is what we got. Just a bowl full of unflavored tapioca jello kind of, kind of stuff. Had to add more water, and it looks like some of these still are a little opaque and might need some more water. But we'll see. Pebbles are also really good at spreading out moisture. So by layering this, I feel like it'll it'll buffer. Now we've got a little jalapeno plant. You know, just enough where the roots are coming in. Little, little bit of algae. No worries. So what I'm gonna do is just make a ooh, this stuff feels weird. Put that in there like that. Stand it up. And ladle around. What are you doing today? Oh, just lay them around. Roll around. Oh, we lost a leaf.
Now to finish off this recipe, a dusting of garnish. Mainly also using these on top so that algae growth doesn't occur as much as I expected. Well, 